Templars. Focus past the Herald. Let her will draw from you. Solus confirms the heavens are scarred but calm. The breach is sealed. We've reports of lingering rifts, and many questions remain. But this was a victory. Word of your heroism has spread. We don't know what caused this. We can't rest easy. I agree. One success does not guarantee peace. The immediate danger is gone. For some, so is the necessity of this alliance. We must be wary. The Inquisition will need new focus. Forces approaching! To arms! We must get to the gate! One watch guard reporting. It's a massive force, the bulk over the mountain. Under what banner? None. None? If someone could open this, I'd appreciate it. Here to warn you. Fashionably late, I'm afraid. Might exhaust it. Don't mind me. There you are. I came to tell you what happened with the mages at Redcliffe. You're not going to like it. They are under the command of the Venatori, in service to something called the Elder One. The woman is Calpurnia. She commands the Venatori. That. on Haven. I risked my life to get here first. Cullen, give me a plan. Anything. Haven is no fortress. If we are to withstand this monster, we must control the battle. Get out there and hit that force. Use everything you can. Soldiers, gather the villagers. Fortify and watch for advanced forces. Inquisition, with the Herald, for your life, for all of us!
going back to the Chantry. It's the only building that might hold against that beast. At this point, just make them work for it. Move! Keep going! The Chantry is your shelter! A brave man. He stood against a Venatori. Briefly, I am no Templar. Harold, our position is not good. That dragon stole back any time you might have earned us. There has been no communication, no demands. Only advance after advance. There was no bargaining with the mages either. This Elder One takes what it wants. From what I gathered in Redcliffe, it marched all of this way to take your herald. I don't care what he wants. How do I stop him? Trust me. That is not information I would keep to myself. And such a promising start with the landslide. <laughs> if only trebuchets remained an option. They are, if we turn the last of them to the mountains above us. We're overrun. To hit the enemy, we'd bury Haven. This is not survivable now. The only choice left is how spitefully we end this. Well, that's not acceptable. I didn't race here only to have you drop rocks on my head. Should we submit? Let him kill us? Dying is typically a last resort, not first. For a Templar, you think like a blood mage. There is a path. You wouldn't know it was there unless you'd made the summer pilgrimage, as I have. The people can escape. She must have shown me. Andraste must have shown me so I could tell you. What are you on about, Roderick? It was whim that I walked the path. I did not mean to start. It was overgrown. Now, with so many in the Conclave dead, to be the only one who remembers... <laughs> I don't know. If this simple memory can save us, this could be more than mere accident. You could be more. If that thing is here for me, I'll make him fight for it. And when the mountain falls, what about you? Perhaps you can surprise the Elder One. Inquisition! Follow Chancellor Roderick through the Chantry. Move! Herald, if you are meant for this, if the Inquisition is meant for this, I pray for you. They'll load the trebuchets. Keep the Elder One's attention until we're above the tree line. If we are to have a chance, if you are to have a chance, let that thing hear you. Move! Now! Pretender, you toy with forces beyond your ken, no more. Whatever you are, I'm not afraid. Words mortals often hurl at the darkness. Once they were mine, they are always lies. Know me, know what you have pretended to be. Exalt. The Elder One. The will that is Corypheus. You 
will. You'll... you'll get nothing out of me! You will resist. You will always resist. It matters not. I am here to anchor. The process of removing it begins now. It is your fault, Geralt. You interrupted a ritual years in the planning, and instead of dying, Stone its purpose. I do not know how you survived, but what marks you as touched, what you flail at rifts, I crafted to assault the very heavens. And you used the anchor to undo my work. The gore. Then your lady wished me to kill you, for her boon is a beacon I cannot let escape. I once breached a fade in the name of another to serve the old gods of the Empire in person. I found only chaos and corruption, dead whispers. For a thousand years I was confused, no more. I have gathered the will to return under no name but my own. To champion Withered to Winter and correct this blighted world. Beg that I succeed, for I have seen the throne of the gods, and it was empty. The anchor is permanent. You have spoilt it with your stumbling. So be it. I will begin again. Find another way to give this world the nation and God it requires. And you, I will not suffer even an unknowing rival. You must die. You expect me to fight, but that's not why I kept you talking. Enjoy your victory. Here's your prize!